Hi everyone, welcome to Simio Art. Today I'm going to show you how you can import audio files or music into Share Factory and also edit it in your videos. So what you want to do on your computer, you want to go to this PC and then you want to format your USB stick fast. So when you click format, you're going to leave the settings as there is FAT23 default and then you click format. But remember, when you format your disk, it's going to erase everything that is on it but I really recommend it in order for your PS4 to be able to read it. So you're going to go ahead and format your disk and then open it. So in here, you're supposed to create a folder and name it Share Factory. You're supposed to create three folders. So the first one is going to be Share Factory and inside Share Factory, you're going to create another folder that you're going to name, uh, let me see, Music. So you're going to name this folder music and in this folder is where you're going to put your music files or your audio files that you want to import to PS4. As you can see, I downloaded a song from YouTube audio library and I just uh, pasted it in here. So now we're going to go ahead and uh, let me first show you the folders you have to create on your disk. You have to create a folder called share factory. So you can see Share Factory here on your disk and inside Share Factory you create music and in music you just paste your folders. So let me go ahead and remove this disk from the computer and we're going to switch over to the PS4 so I can show you the steps on the PS4. Alright, so now we're in the PS4 and I open Share Factory and I'm going to show you exactly what you're supposed to do. Uh, in the Share Factory, this is like the main page. As soon as you open it up, you go to Import Content and you're going to scroll over to the right and say import music so in the import music you're going to here it's going to show you import from usb and it's what you're going to click on and you can see my music here charongos the one i just downloaded from youtube audio library and you're going to click x to select it and you click the box button to import it and now you can see it's in my share factory library so what's going to happen is now I'm going to go ahead and open my recent project. And in my recent project, I'm going to go ahead and try to add this song in order for, uh, for me to show you how it exactly works. So I'm going to go ahead here, my last project. This is a project, it's just the intros uh, that they provide on this thing. And I'm just going to add this music to it so you guys can see how it works. So I'm going to go to add clip. Uh, no, add music and you can see here charongos it's the first song that is on here on the list and I'm gonna go ahead and add it and it's also important that you name your things appropriately you name your files appropriately in order for you to be able to find them you can see here if I try to play it you can see it's playing pretty good in my intro here you see that so that's how you add it and then here you can show off your editing skills just the way you want. You can make the music balance pretty perfectly because I know Share Factory does a great job uh, to try to edit music and to also try to edit high quality videos. So you can see here, this is where you now your talent starts showing up. Uh, you can edit the music into the video just the way you want it. And this could be, uh, you know, commentary. If say you're playing and you record your commentary on a different device, say on your computer, while you're playing on PS4, uh, I would actually recommend that you record audio differently from your videos, especially if you're playing video games, because you can go back and edit it separately to show exactly where you want it to come through. Say you're playing your video game, and where you don't want to, come, you don't want it to come through. For example, here you can see. I took the video audio off and the music that I just imported is the one that is playing. And here I left it on. You can see how that's beautiful. Anyways, thank you so much for watching guys and I hope to see you again in the next video. Bye bye for now.